We are a family owned retail store and I work here with my grandmother. She's the owner. So in 1956, my great grandfather owned it and it was just a clothing store. But I will work here every day after I came home from school. And while I was in college, I was here every weekend. So I was, I knew all about the store. And then in 1985, my grandmother took over. In my family, being Lebanese, they always thought the oldest son should be named for a business. And my daddy named it Edmonds, which was his, my brother's first name. And then when I inherited, people would say, well, I couldn't find Libby, so I just put a slash after it because I did not want to take my brother's name away from it. And I put Libby's beside on it, so if they look Libby's, they can find it. And then I came along and we just kind of put our minds together. And just over the years, it's just, it's growing. We try to keep our customers happy. We just keep ordering new merchandise from Simply Southern shirts, rainbow sandals, Yankee candles, jewelry, pocketbooks, basically a woman's world. I enjoy talking with the customers and I have customers that come in and they'll ask me, hey, you just, I need this for a gift, you pick it out. And I'm like, okay, and I'll put it together. And most people, they remember this store and they will come and talk to me about different things. I'm like a museum in a way. And, uh... <laughs> Why Benson, honestly? Well, I was raised here my whole life. And like I said, it's family owned. And I just, for me, I grew up into it. You know, retail. I love it. <laughs>